Even today, 65% of Indians reside in rural areas. More than 50% of these rural households still depend on agriculture as their major income source. These households have been plagued by lack of infrastructure and opportunities, causing them to live in substandard conditions from generations. We at Inacta Society Bombay set out to address this problem in the village of Khoste, a tribal village situated at 80 kilometers from Mumbai with a population of 400 people. Based on a survey conducted by our team, we found that over 60 families in Khoste are engaged in agriculture and more than 90% of these families experience severe income instability owing to the seasonal nature of agriculture and lack of alternate income sources due to remoteness of the village. After deliberating over various solutions, we came up with an idea that would transform the remoteness of Khoste into an engine for its growth. And so, Project Atithi was born. With Project Atithi, our aim is to harness a hidden potential of Khoste and transform it into a prime tourist destination leading to employment generation and infrastructural development in the village. Now you might wonder why a tourist destination? Well, due to being a remote and isolated village, Khoste possesses a pristine land booming with natural beauty. From jasmine plantations to unventured hills, from waterfalls to forests with a plethora of flora and fauna, each step takes you away from urban life. Additionally, the village has a huge scope for agritourism which offers city dwellers a chance to experience unique quirks of the village and rediscover their rural roots. To start off with our project, we conducted multiple visits to Khoste to understand possible activities that could be started. Eventually, we came up with two trip models. A day trip model with activities like village tour, jungle trail, bamboo craft, sapling plantation and an overnight trip model with additional activities like bonfire camping, stargazing and trekking. After planning the activities, we discussed them with the villagers to recruit volunteers and laid out a revenue distribution plan amongst various stakeholders like activity guides, hosts and the village committee. Logistics like tents, pillows and blankets were provided through bootstrapping within the team. For marketing and publicity, we curated a website containing extensive details like highlights from the trips, available modes of transport, and also provision for tourists to book their trips along with a complete itinerary and schedule for the trips. The website also contains detailed information about all the activities that we plan to do. Along with this, we made a two-minute promotional video and a brochure as a reference for interested tourists. We are currently in the process of building our other online marketing channels on Instagram, Facebook and YouTube. Next, we plan to conduct a few pilot tourist runs to get feedbacks and improve upon the existing trip models. After successful pilot runs, we plan to reach out and partner with travel agencies for organizing regular trips. Subsequently, we plan to conduct one-day picnics for school students and invite groups from various non-profit clubs based in Mumbai to get larger tourist groups and word-of-mouth publicity. Based on our business model, 60% of the revenue will be shared by direct beneficiaries, while 35% will be aggregated in a village fund for overall village welfare and infrastructural development. We estimate to generate a monthly revenue of 40,000 rupees by early next year and upskill over 20 villagers, increasing their income by up to 60%. We intend to address the following UN Sustainable Development Goals and we strongly believe that Project Atithi has a huge impact potential to reshape Khoste's future and empower the village for a better tomorrow. We invite you to come and experience the beauty, culture and richness of rural India.